All right, we're here with Coach Dennis Hohenschild of the women's volleyball team here at UVA. Went one and two last weekend out at Colorado State. Tell us about the weekend. Uh, it was uh, it was productive uh, in numerous ways. I think you know um, the first night Colorado State, we got to play in front of a large crowd, about 3,500 people. Um, so it was good for the kids to to play in a big arena in front of a lot of people against a very 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 good team. Uh, I thought the kids um, played pretty well. I think they executed for the most part. We, we just have to learn how to finish some games right now. There's little things we have to do against a good team like that. Uh, the next morning we uh, played pretty well against a, a good Rhode Island team. We did some nice things and uh, I, I was most disappointed how we played against Denver. And you know I don't know if it was just a long day or, or what, but I didn't think we were real sharp. Uh, both physically and mentally and, and that was probably the most disappointing thing but you know these weeks uh, you learn a little bit about yourself and uh, there's some things I think we're pretty good at right now um, and those are the things we've been working on for the first two weeks um, so I'm excited that we were good at them there's some things that we're not so good at uh, and I thought we wouldn't be good at because we haven't spent a lot of time on it so uh, we've identified those things already uh, started working on them this week and so um, hopefully this week will be better that's the goal is to be better every week or every match that you play so uh, that's where that's the direction we're headed right now one player who uh, did pretty well is uh, Tori Janowski named to the all tournament team she's uh, made a switch this year she's uh, doing some setting and playing outside hitter uh, talk about her performance uh, you know I think um, our decision to do that was simply because Tori's a pretty good setter and a pretty good hitter, and it's just sort of the system that we have. It wasn't a great master plan or anything. It's just sort of evolved into that. Um, I thought Tori um, did some very nice things. Um, I think Tori still has a lot of things she needs to work on that we've discussed about. Um, do I think Jess Oshoni could have been all tournament team instead of Tori? Yeah. Do I think Roddy could have been all tournament team instead of Tori? Yeah. Um, so I think there's three choices. I think those are the three kids that I thought were pretty consistent throughout the weekend. And so I'm excited for Tori that she got recognized. Um, as I told her, it's, uh, it's a great thing. I've moved on already from it. So, um, but I'm happy for her, you know, and, um, and Tori's a fantastic volleyball player, and I think she's only getting it better. Uh, and hopefully this move with her setting and hitting's the right thing. Um, I think it is right now. And so um, we're going to keep doing it, and hopefully she keeps playing at that level and gets better. Okay. And uh, coming up this weekend, uh, first home games at Memorial Gym. Uh, we've got Delaware, uh, Western yeah. Kentucky, and Lehigh coming to yeah. town. Tell us a little bit about what you're looking to accomplish. Uh, well, you know, I think the biggest thing is I, I think all three of those teams are pretty good. You know, um, people say Western Kentucky, Delaware, Lehigh, and I say, well, there's two or three tournament teams um, there, right there. Uh, and it actually, if I'm not mistaken, Delaware got to the round of 32, I think it was last year at Penn State. So um, it's tournament teams, and, and so those teams are good. Um, and so – they might not be uh, the BCS teams, but in the volleyball world, I think they're very, very, very good. Uh, and right now, we're aspiring to get to their level. That's that's if we can get. That's the first goal is to get to that level. Um, so they'll they'll be a very good test. I know West Kentucky had a good, tough weekend last weekend playing Louisville, Penn State, and Moorhead State last weekend. So they've been tested early. Uh, so they they had a really tough weekend last weekend, and and I know. Uh, they'll be ready to play. Same thing, I think Delaware was out in California. I think they played Cal and Long Beach maybe. I'm not, I haven't gotten that deep into the schedule, but I know they played Cal. So, uh, I mean Cal and San Diego State. So uh, I know those two teams have been tested already. So uh, I hope that our trip to Colorado State probably pre prepared us as well as other trips prepared them. So I hope that's probably a wash. I, you know, I know the kids are excited to play at home. I'm excited for my first time at home. I know the staff's excited to play at home. And, and hopefully we can get some people in the gym and um, pack it, make it loud, and, and have a nice home court advantage. And, and our goal is, is to beat Western Kentucky. We'll beat Western Kentucky and then uh, our plan to beat Western Kentucky and put a plan for them. And then 
the girls know I'm a step by step person. Then we move on to then we move on to Lehigh, and then we move on to Delaware. We don't look ahead of anyone. So um, hopefully. Uh, the girls are, are looking at Western Kentucky. We'll get some film and we'll start to not analyze them a little bit and uh, figure out what's going on. So, um, very excited right now at this stage. Um, I like where we're at. Would I like to have three wins? Sure. Um, but we're sort of right on schedule where I think we should be. Um, and hopefully this week we're going to correct some of the things we weren't good at and be ready to play. And then. We analyze after this weekend, and hopefully we're ready for the third weekend. And then we analyze, and now we're ready for Virginia Tech. You know, so to me, uh, we try to get wins and analyze every weekend. But to me, we're shooting for that Friday night home match against Virginia Tech that fourth weekend. That to me is when I want us to be full force, um, staffs on top of things, players on top of things, and, and we're ready to go for ACC. All right. Thanks for joining us, you Coach Owen. Thanks. No problem.